So today we're talking about sit-ups. So there's two different ways that you can do sit-ups. The traditional way is with your feet directly out in front of you. And the modified way to do that is what we call more of a butterfly position. So this is where those feet are in kind of that groin stretch position. And the difference between these is in this position, with your feet out in front, you're gonna rely a lot more on your hip flexors to help pull that upper torso up towards your feet. Now, when you go with the butterfly position, what it does is it relaxes those hip flexors and your abs are gonna do a lot more of the work. So you're gonna get a lot more of a core workout. So how to do them, and if you guys haven't worked with this before, what this is, is it's an ab mat. And you see it kind of contours to that lower back as such, and it's placed on the ground. And what it does is it stretches that midsection out a lot more. So you're gonna get a little bit extra of a workout because it's gonna stretch. And then of course that contraction coming back up as you're doing the sit-ups is gonna give you that better workout. So I'm gonna use them for this. So I'll first show you the original one, with the, or the traditional one with the feet out in front. Now you can anchor these under a dumbbell or a rack, something if you need to. Otherwise, let's put them out about a 45 degree angle with those feet. You'll come back, stretching that midsection until those shoulders touch. And then from there, coming up, touching down by those feet. Now, the old way of doing these was with those hands behind your head. And if you can do that without pulling on your neck, then you're fine doing it. But sometimes I find, especially as people start to get fatigued, is they kind of pull themselves up, jerking that neck forward. And of course, we don't want to do that. So that's Option number one is to do again that traditional way, or if you're doing the butterfly version, which is again gonna give you that more, a little bit more of an abdominal workout. They're gonna work a little bit harder. It's the same exact same, same that exact thing. You're only switching up where your foot position is. So same thing, I come back, stretching that midsection, those shoulders touch at the bottom. Then I pop up, touching those feet, or touching those hands, right down by those feet. There you go guys, that's how you do. Sit up.